You guys thought this was big? Get a load of this bad boy right here. What is going on guys? We are back today with another RC review. And I gotta tell you guys, man, I am pissed off. I am fuming. And that is because of this freaking truck right here. And if you guys don't know, that is the New Bright Mudslinger. There you go, New Bright. And uh, dude, this uh, this is part of their RC RC truck series. And I gotta tell you guys, this is by far one of the worst RCs I have ever had the displeasure of driving. This thing is absolutely a piece of crap. And guess what? How much this thing's worth? $80 at Toys R Us. Dear Lord. So, you know, from a, from a glance, this actually looks pretty badass. You know, when I saw it inside the package, I was like, damn, you know, the Mudslinger, this thing is huge. Look at my hand compared to this. Look, this thing is humongous. Look at this. It, it won't even fit in the camera. Okay? It's huge. So, you know, I saw it in the packaging. I'm like, oh, my God, this thing is huge. You know, 80 bucks. I understand. You know what? Let's give it a try. And um, the first thing that gave it away was actually the weight. That's right. This thing doesn't weigh anything. Literally, this thing weighs less than like two pounds. Look at this. Watch this, guys. Watch this. Okay. Look. Let me, let me pick it up from here. Pinky. Pinky. Lifting this up with my pinky. This car doesn't weigh anything. Okay. So I was like, okay, it doesn't weigh anything. It doesn't have any weight to it. That's that's maybe because you know there's a new design and they're going all high tech and all that. Well, you know what? Here's. Let's get under the car. Let's get under things for, for a change and see exactly, look at this. This is one solid plastic body. Look at this. Look at these tires. Look at this crap. This is like, we're back in like the 90s. Not even, there's toy grade cars back in the 90s that had better design quality than this. Look at this, no springs. Just a full hunk of plastic molded out. Just the body, the outside looks cool. That's about it, look at this. Just a giant one solid piece of plastic. There's no springs in the back at all. No springs on the side. No springs in the front. Okay, the tires, freaking made out of plastic. Okay, this thing, dude, 80 bucks for this piece of crap. Check, but this is the worst part. This comes with a 2.4 gigahertz controller. And let me see if I could come out to the light a little bit. I need to show you guys this. I have never seen a cheaper RC control in my life. I am telling I have I've had plenty of toy grade RC cars. I've never seen anything. Look at this. So cheap. This this is like look at this. Look at the build quality. This is it doesn't even guys this is like this is freaking crazy. It doesn't even go forward all the way. It doesn't go left and right all the way. Look at the quality of this. Oh my god, this is one of the worst controls I've ever seen. This is made out of like water bottle, like plastic. It, it feels like, look at this. I swear to god, man, do not buy this RC, okay? It's called the New Bright Mudslinger, okay? It looks like this, if you guys see it. At Walmart and toys, this thing runs like crap, it drives like crap. As you guys are gonna see in the footage, do not, I repeat, do not waste eighty dollars on this car. Do not buy it. Stay away. All right. So I hope you guys enjoyed that quick little RC review, the new bright mud slinger. Until next time, guys.